Second thing you can do with already existing course length files is a cumulative distribution fitting. If you want to do this, select CDF and here you have to select a folder where your existing course length files are located. Should be in the results directory, mine is sample results. So then you see the content of the folder and you can select one or more course length files one by just clicking on it. If you want to select more, uh, hold the control, uh, the control key and click on the course length files you want to select. Here in this window you see how many files are selected. Uh, for the first I want to make a CDF of only one file. So I select it. Um, you have to be sure that the scale bar is the right one, the same we did in the file thing. So you look here, there is nanometer and you have to select nanometer in here. So you can press start and then you see the distribution fitting of the chord lengths in this file. So you can give this curve a name. This is sample 1 and you will see it in the legend here. You have the same options as you know. Uh, you can change the limits and so on. Uh, here in this window you see the, the data of this curve, so the minimum value, the maximum value, the mean, the median and so on. For more help uh, use the MATLAB help for CDF plot. Uh, if you're ready you can press show and get a figure which you can edit and save. The next thing you can do is add another course length files in the same diagram. So just click on it and if you want to show both curves in one diagram uh, you have to select hold. Then just press start and you will see the second one in here. This is sample 2. Um, the next thing you can do is you can make a cumulative distribution fitting uh, over more than one file. So if you select two files and press start then you will see the cumulative distribution fitting of the course lengths in both files. So this is sample 1 plus 2. Okay, if you want to see more of the details, here you can scroll over this table 1, 2, 3, and you have the, the data of this curves. Okay, that's it.